This game would be a great torture simulator. I'm just walking back and forth, back and forth, up and down the steps. Just sit back and enjoy the show. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to part one, I think, of Finger Bones. Um, this is a psychological horror game. Oh, wait, no, it's... never mind. Not part one, there ain't no parts, it's a single sitting kind of game. So, Finger Bones is intended to be completed in a single sing... single sing, 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 Single sitting. And there is no safe function to suggest that you set aside about half an hour to complete it. To exit, visit the door you started at. Use wads... wads... To move, and the left mouse button to interact with the environment. Press escape to toggle the screen, and I to invert the mouse. So, a psychological horror. Let's see. So you can't sprint. It's always great. A lot of do more hours to the fucking gameplay of this. Shit. Uh, oh, oh. It's my weekend to get Katie, but I'm really not in the mood. I distracted her with a TV and came here to read. I couldn't interest myself in reading, so I tried to write. I couldn't write anything more than the usual handful of disconnected thoughts and theories. Medication didn't help and to force serious- uh, Certainly didn't help, because I'm not depressed. I'm enlightened. This is the result of two decades of scientific education and philosophical pondering. This is the price of knowledge. Ooh. Fancy. Right, so. This is the kind of game where I'm assuming we gotta go click and read things. When I was fifth oh dear. When I was 15 years old, I lost my virginity. Ooh, uh. I shook uncontrollably the entire time. I felt that same primal excitement yesterday night in the cellar. Oh dear. Interesting. I'm often masturbate in the cellar. So there's no flashlight either, and I don't think we can interact with drawers. No, we can't. Right. It appears to be a page from a manuscript. Pop morality is too reliant on emotions, and not reliant enough on rational thought. If morality must be determined, and I maintain that it is a farce, it should not be determined by feeling. Feelings on the bell. The, 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 the bullies? I don't know how to say that. Nebulous. I was going to say that. Subjective and changeable. Rather, it should be determined by thinking. The actions of a natural creature are natural and thus morale, unless a concrete scientific reason can be given to prove them as immoral. Take that, science, I think. So, I'm, I'm sorry if this video isn't very funny, because apparently this isn't meant to be a game that's taken very seriously. Ooh! Flashlight! Ah! Meant to be a game that's taken very seriously, as you can tell by the tone of my voice. So, wait, what? Is this all? Like, is it just this one room? I don't know why I'd use my daughter's name as a door lock code in my survival bunker, but whatever keeps her happy, I suppose. She's like her mother, a delicate, fragile version of her mother. Damn her. Damn her. Can I toggle this off and on? So, wait, I'm confused. Is this, like, the only room we can go to? Unless... What's this? Ooh, can we push the button? No! No thank you, you'll attract the monsters! Stop it! What is that, a generator? Oh, there's a red light over there. God, he moves so slow! This isn't even walking speed! Oh, what's this thing? This wasn't here before, was it? I don't know. Um... What the fuck is that? I don't know what the hell that is. Oh wait, his daughter's name. Katie, Katie, there we go. Look, I'm doing puzzles! Oh. What did it do? Was that wrong? I'm assuming that buzzing means it's wrong. Why is that wrong? I'm confused. I thought that was right. Ah, oh, the phone! Damn it, phone! And we're back. Sorry for that. Apparently Virgin Mobile really, really, really wants my opinion on what the fuck they're about, and I promptly told them to go fuck themselves. So, I'm assuming I don't go for that door. What's in here? Oh god. Oh god, no! Whoo! Whoo! Hello? Whew. This is awful. 
It finally happened. The whole world is a chaos of thunder and screams. And when the ashes settle, we will be wild animals again. I'm ecstatic beyond words. I haven't been able to reach Lynn for several days, and she's probably dead for all I know or care. But Katie was here when it started. I have no idea what to do with her. Most of the town is dead. Katie and I only survived because we ran to the bunker. Perhaps this is what I've needed. Freedom from all the irrational rules and innate social values. Just pure, beautiful survival. So, Lynn is a possible name for the code of the door. What's this? Uh, click it. Excuse you? Oh. Okay. We're just gonna go right on upstairs and pretend that never happened. Oh, Ooh, that, sent, that sent shivers. That shivered me timbers. Whew, Jesus. Ah, why did that make me shiver so much? Alright, Lynn. Let's try Lynn. No? What the fuck? What is it? What? I don't understand. What am I doing wrong? Alright, just click on everything, please. Oh, by the way, I should probably announce I'm not doing Cry of Fear anymore because literally that game's the worst piece of shit that I've ever played. It's fucking boring. Alright, what's this? This looks different. What does this do? It says I can click on it, I think. I don't know, I'm just talking shit. What is the daughter's name? I'm assuming that that's what that's for, right? Try Katie. Oh, wait, is it Katie or is it Kate? It's Katie, right? Yeah, Katie. It's my weekend to get Katie. That's the kind of thing you'd say about a child. Oh, Steam has finished downloading Payday 2. If I leave this, it'll exit the game, so I can't go that way, so... What do you want from me? I can't quit you because... I can't continue otherwise. Wait, what? This didn't open before. Oh, excuse you. Oh, God. I got... Oh! Oh, God! Don't do anything, woman. Fucking hairs everywhere standing up on edge. I didn't even know I had hair. She remembered Father's Day and drew me a picture. I don't understand her. She's just like a mother. She wants to waste time drawing pictures, and we're barely able to find enough food to survive. Ugh. I turned her crayons into candles. We need more candles in case the generator goes out again, and it helps break up the monoton- mon Oh, God. Monotony. I yearn for the excitement of the first weeks. Oh, oh God. Please just be an atmospheric horror, and don't let anything scary happen. There are things I've wanted to do for years. Desires I've kept locked in the back of my consciousness. It's ne- <laughs> It's been nearly a year since I've seen a woman. Now I realize there's no practical reason to keep those desires locked. Oh dear. Oh dear. I know where this is going. It's not good. Shut up, ghost! I ain't got time for your shit. I changed the storing the storage room code to something I can easily remember. N N Y, the rest the rest of the w word is missing. God, I can't read today. N N Y. Right, no. What the fuck? N N Y. I don't fucking know. Did I read this? I boxed up everything that isn't practical and useful. I burned all the books that weren't for scientific ed edification. Bleh. I'd like to store the boxes in the cellar, but I can't get them down the ladder myself. I just piled them up near the hatch. The blood would probably ruin them anyway. Oh dear. I don't want to go down there. And there's ghosty goos down there. We don't like those. Come on, sis. Maybe the sink has something to do with the story. Plot, as it were. Uh, what what could the password be? What's that behind there? I can see something. 
What's that? What's that? I don't care. I'm just in it for the scares. I'm not really. Well, I am. Oh, note! A hidden note! The tool room has been her name for years now. I can't bring myself to change it. What's the name? Stop teasing me, game! Oh, it's been her name for ages. What's her name? I don't know. I'm just talking shit. That's my specialty, you see. I like to talk shit when I don't know what I'm doing. That way, the player can be confused in this monotonous, engaging puzzle game of which it's very gamey. Did I mention that this is a game? Alright, I've come back up to this fucking room with still no knowledge as to what the code is. I don't want to cheat! I didn't even beep that time. I turn the game back up now. That's mouse sensitivity. Did I turn the mouse sensitivity down? I hope I didn't, otherwise I'm just a mom. <laughs> Uh, the game's too loud, but it turned down the mouse sensitivity. Uh, that's better. I'm not very good at puzzle games. That's like my thing. I'm like absolutely fucking useless. Shut up, ghost! Oh god! I swear to God, I, I don't need. No, thank you. I don't want any. I'm not interested. Oh, oh god! Hairs everywhere, standing on head. Ah, don't like ghosts. I don't know anyone that does, to be fair. Why was the rest of the word missing? Like, did he just say, start writing it down, and half of it went, nah, you're alright. Can't be bothered, if I'm honest. This, let's just give me anything, like blood written on the wall. I forget. Fuck off, Charlie. Messaging me and shit. You don't get to message me. Uh, apparently the last thing I searched was, was Sauron an elf? The way I understand it is you read notes and apparently it unlocks doors. That's apparently how it works. There's not one up there, is it? There's not one over there, nope. What is this? What is this thing? I mean, why is there like a random indentation in the door? Do you know what this wall needs? What? A square. You're a genius, monsieur. Ah! Okay. Okay. So when I enter a name, it buzzes. Um, no, it's, it's just Katie, isn't it? Maybe if I write, type in mother, will that open up another door? Um, damn, I thought I had it for a second then. Yeah, they weren't kidding when they said you set aside at least half an hour. Because they knew retards like me were going to play. I apologize for my, I, actually no, I don't apologize for my use of language, fuck you. Oh, God. Shut up, ghost! What? Who? Oh, God! I hate games like this! Why did I put myself through this torture? I'm sick of it! I can't do it anymore! I'm contemplating crying. I hate the internet. I really do. Are you fucking serious? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, God! Ah! Ah! Nothing's working! I can't look at any walkthroughs! Oh, this is gonna be the death of me! Why can't games just be fun? They don't need to be difficult! I don't play games to get pissed off with them, I play games to have fun! Oh god... Give me a sign! Anything! I'll take anything! Fuck. I <laughs> typed in finger bones names, and it came up with the hand of a skeleton. That's not what I meant, Google. That's not what I meant. Why? Why is it the YouTube app working? Cunt! Cunt! Ah! I'm just doomed to wander through this building all on my own. I've managed to read three notes, turn on a generator, and then scream about a game for 15 minutes. Oh my god, if I ain't the gaming master, I don't know who is. What is that behind there? Move! Don't like this game. Regret everything I've ever done. This game has put my life into perspective, and I hate it. Not even like a slightly, like a slightest bit of help. That just doesn't offer any progression in this game. Ah! <laughs> ah! 
This game would be a great torture simulator. I'm just walking back and forth, back and forth, up and down the stairs. Uh, uh, fucking Katie Lynn, Katie Lynn. Oh God, fuck your pop morality, you bitch. Oh, I'm getting real sick of your shit, finger bones. <laughs> <laughs> Just tell me what I need to do. Anything. What does NNY mean? NNY what? What even is this? What is this? Who made this? David Szymanski, you're a shit. And I hate you. You know what? I'm done. We're leaving. Fucking game.